Craig Kelly posted the following on social media. He stated, I'm just about to board QF650 for what I thought was a direct flight from Perth to Sydney, but the sign at the gate seems to indicate that the flight goes to Gadigal country. Kelly goes on today, the Americans sitting next to me are very confused. We say, what the fuck is Gadigal country? We surmise the homo cunts at Qantas have taken it upon themselves to rename Australia with ABO names. If you think this is bad, just watch the avalanche of bullshit. We'll see if the voice gets up. You won't hear the end of the whining, virtue signaling, and fucking with every aspect of your life. Freedom of movement will go out the door. You won't be able to freely travel. You won't even recognize where you're going with all the name changes and restrictions. There will be forced welcome to country roadside haranguing as you travel through every municipality and state. Just make it stop, we say. We can't even go to the footy anymore without being subjected to this crap. You think I'm kidding? Look what happened to Ayers Rock. It started with a bullshit apology, progressed to a name change to Uluru, and then they shut down the fucking place. These motherfuckers will shut down the country if you don't wake up. Rest assured, it's not your outback Aboriginal who is doing this. It's half caste as white as you, cocksucker politicians, starting with Albanese and the woke-type fuckers you see on the ABC. That leprechaun homo cocksucker at Qantas is behind this gadgil country bullshit. Tell the voice fuckers to fuck off. Australia is fine the way it is. Leave us alone.